Welcome back, everyone. This is Raw. Coming to you live from ringside, where I can barely hear myself think. Keep your butt in that chair, because we've got a heck of a show in store. I look at this card, and my mouth starts to water. Singles match coming up next. Now, don't go anywhere. We have a classic coming up. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date against Kane. Who will reign supreme? He's ready to go. This is a big match. Big, big match for this young man. Couldn't find his way in title contention with a win tonight. And he doesn't look like he's ready for action, I'll tell you that. No, not at all. Is the match going to happen or not? Good question. making his way to the ring now, guys. This is a big opportunity for Bo Dallas, Cole. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stomach. Okay, let's get this match going. Chopping down trees right and left. What a blow. Delivers the breaker. He's simply reminding him that he's here. That'll slow Bo Dallas down a bit. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Yeah, but it looks to me like he still has plenty of energy in that body of his. I wouldn't look too much into this right now. Let's take a moment to discuss D. What, in your opinion, can we all expect from him tonight? Here's somebody who's willing to do just about anything to get to the top, and that's the way it should be here in WWE. All I can say is he definitely looks the part, and sometimes that helps, believe it or not. He hits the clothesline. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. What is it that Bo Dallas can do here for a physical and psychological revival at this juncture? He doesn't want to absorb much more punishment if he wants to win this match. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now, guys. He's going to want to make some changes if he wants to stay in it. Hey, he can still win this thing, guys. We've all seen him come back from much worse. Just making his presence felt there. Bo Dallas got him there. Keep your eye on this one. He's not getting up. You can't like his chances right now. He wants no part of this. Look at this. What a clothesline. line. 
You have to possess a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. Look out! He gets him with the overhand punch. Oh, he turns it around. Oh, no. We know what this is. Down with a face buster. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. We may have discovered his favorite move. He is a one-man gang in there. Nope, that one misses. Boy, that was terrible. Showing very few signs of life here. Yeah, there's no way he comes back from this. Might as well ring the bell now. Ain't no stopping him now. Oh, he's able to reverse it. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Despite having an impressive spot in this week's power rankings, I'm told this superstar isn't all concerned with things like that. He goes down hard. Yeah, he's not looking very good at this point, Cole. That misses the mark. That wasn't even close, Michael. And he goes down hard. Yeah, and I think he might have slipped a little, too. Just making his presence felt there. Uh, going to the top, high risk. He's got, look at this! He's looking at it. Bo Dallas isn't being shy, that's for sure. That one misses big time. Better luck next time. He is a one-man gang in there. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. He's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? That one was off the mark. Awful. Just plain awful. Sheamus might want to rethink this showboating. Bo Dallas is calling for it. And the shoulder's up in time. Tried for it early. Oh, he refuses to stay down. Yeah, he is super motivated tonight. If you're this superstar, you gotta be happy about where you're listed in the recent power rankings. Now momentum is in the corner of Bo Dallas. A move like that is completely unnecessary, unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. Saw that one coming. The RKO, see you next time. It's just not Bo Dallas' night, guys. This should do it right there. One, two, three. There's the pinfall and the victory. Kicking off the night with an impressive victory.
and you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. What a match, and a quick thank you to everybody for spending part of their Christmas with us here at the WWE. Up next, we have singles action. It'll be Titus O'Neil taking on some tough competition. Oh, I cannot wait. Listen up, there's not a moment to spare. It's quite a drop from the top, so how are you feeling down there? Where did you think you'd go? Because everyone already knows it's 20 to 1. Yes, so you better run. You got the world on its knees. You're taking all that you please. You want more. Go on. But you get nothing from me. You like the burden we bear. Here we go, matchup's gonna be a good one. Superstar ready for action. Here comes his opponent, wasting little time to start things off. There's the double leg takedown on the big right hands. Here we go, this thing's breaking down before it even gets started. Chaos ensuing here. Incredible. He tackles him to the ground. Done. Here we go. Back inside the ring. Titus O'Neil is feeding off this WWE universe. Not today. Whoops, not even close. What was he thinking? Titus O'Neil is making his presence known. A wild overhead punch wreaking havoc in here. That move at this juncture of the match makes the intention unmistakable to be little. Ain't no stopping him now. He may have discovered his favorite move. And he lands a nice counter. And he just found out that's not the place you want to be. Can he end it quickly? And Titus O'Neil powers out. What a kick out. The back region taking the brunt of the punishment here. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. And a lethal clothesline. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. <sighs> Titus O'Neil with the clash of the Titus. That should do it. This rivalry has just been taken to the next one's over.
start the show. If that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. When we return, it's a battle where the participants will need to know where they are at all times. We have Sheamus and Cesaro against the Revival. I don't know about anyone else, but I circled this one on the calendar. for this one. So am I, Michael. I've been looking forward to this match for a long, long time. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. one as well as they should be this match has instant classic written all over it and before we go any further i'd like to extend a very merry christmas to our wwe universe watching at home uh, i echo those sentiments michael and i hope that santa was good to everybody out there even you corey i hope he brings you coal byron get this match going oh man this is going to be great this would be a main event in any arena across the country but guys tonight the great people here in east lansing are the lucky ones oh man oh 
have your thoughts here on Sheamus. In your expert opinion, what can the WWE Universe expect to see from him? There is a ton of talent in that ring right now, but this is certainly somebody to keep an eye on as this match progresses. Well, he's trained all his life to be here. It's either going to pay off or not. We'll see real soon. Using his knee now. There's a chilling fury that's behind Sheamus' eyes. The Celtic Warriors' goal is to pummel whoever steps in front of him in his quest to dominate WWE. Scott Dawson is a force within the ring. And the shoulder's up in time. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. Over the course of his career, the Celtic Warrior has proven to be one of the most dangerous superstars in WWE. Sheamus has shown his ability to seize opportunity at anyone's expense, hence being a former Mr. Money in the Bank. Sheamus is battle-tested and can inflict serious harm on whoever he feels deserves it. Just look at the classic Best of Seven series the Celtic Warrior had with Cesaro in 2016. And the ropes break this one up. Great ring awareness there, Michael. to the ring. I don't know where he gets the energy, but it seems endless right now. He's simply reminding him that he's here. And he connects with the missile drop kick. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. That one misses big time. Better luck next time. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Incoming. He goes to the leg drop. Just making his presence felt there. Reversal. Cesaro showing his prowess. And there's the counter. Man, Wilder is feeling it right here. Absolutely has to get back in the ring. There's no way around it. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. Two. That's Wilder has him up. Backbreaker. Corey, that looked familiar. This might be it, guys. I don't think I'd be showboating if I was Dawson. Six. He wants no part of the outside. He's not going to like this. With the code breaker. Game, set, match. This one is over. Textbook takedown. There's the cover. Can he do it? Two, three, we go. A 
win like that says a lot about a duo. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. When you put these two together, victory is really the only plausible outcome. Thank you for tuning in tonight, folks. We hope you enjoyed that great match. Don't change that channel. We have singles action. Coming up next, we have Finn Balor versus Darren Young. Listen up, there's not a moment to spare. It's quite a drop from the top, so how are you feeling down there? Where did you think you could go? Because everyone already knows it's 20 to 1. Yes, yeah, so you better run. You got the world on its knees. You're taking all that you please. You want more. Yeah. But you get nothing from me. You like the burden we bear. You love the hate that we share. draft and before I forget allow me to wish everybody out there a very Merry Christmas you know I can't help but wonder what I did wrong to have to be spending Christmas sitting next to you two
As we ready for singles action, Byron, what can you tell us about these two competitors? Well, I can say that both of these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance here tonight. But as we all know, only one will walk away with their arm raised in victory. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. D. Young certainly made a name for himself here in WWE as Mr. No Days Off. His climb to the top of WWE has been steady, and elbows aren't supposed to bend that way, people, but I guess that's what the cross arm bar is for. Getting nailed with a strike like that lets you know just what kind of fight you're in. Oh, God. That was hitting the nail right on the head. If he takes many more of those, he's going to get lit up like a Christmas tree. Guys, I want to discuss Darren Young for a moment. So what can these WWE fans expect out of him tonight? I can't wait to see how this one plays out, Michael. Both of these guys look like they refuse to lose here tonight. This is some great offense by Finn Balor. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Darren Young gathering attention in a hurry. No, they're not done yet, not even close. And we continue. There's a drop kick, nice move. Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Whoa. Whoa. He's simply reminding him that he's here. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Look at this. The WWE Universe has cheered Darren Young on for years, and when Bob Backlund launched the campaign to make Darren great again, everyone couldn't wait to see what was next for the beloved Mr. No Days Off. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. He's back in control here. Darren Young just getting overwhelmed. Putting it all on the line. Look at this. You'd have to think hitting the finisher here could end this thing. A brutal clothesline catches in the perfect spot. Darren Young in some trouble here. Looks to me like he just hit a wall. At this point, he's risking serious injury by continuing. I mean, he's getting absolutely torn apart in there. Here he goes. Coup de grace. That's what he was looking for. My shoulders down. This could be it. Two, three. And this match is over.
your winner, Finn Balor. And that's a win to start off the night. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win here tonight. and ready to make a point. He's not going to keep us waiting, so let's find out. No lacking for confidence, that's for sure. going to get interesting. Let's listen and see. I guess believing you can do something sometimes makes it so, huh? Not making any friends, but not really concerned about it either.
doesn't even begin to describe the blood between these superstars. Somebody needs to count the 10. Did anyone else get that? Thankfully, that thing, whatever it was, is over. Not exactly world shattering, but I guess he tried. A great way to lead into the next matchup, which should be a good one. Triple threat action coming up next. We're moments away from pure chaos. The triple threat match is next. When three superstars step into the ring, you never know what you're going to get. Exciting, we have to remember that triple threat matches are incredibly dangerous, especially when a two on one attack takes place, which is inevitably going to happen at some point here tonight, Michael. And before I forget, allow me to wish everybody out there a very Merry Christmas. You know, I can't help but wonder what I did wrong to have to be spending Christmas sitting next to you two.
Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. coming up as three of WWE's top superstars are set to square off. And Michael, I can realistically envision any one of these three competitors having their hand raised in victory here tonight. And before we go any further, I'd like to extend a very Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Uh, I echo those sentiments, Michael, and I hope that Santa was good to everybody out there. Even you, Corey. I hope he brings you coal, Byron. Here we go as this triple threat match gets underway. The unpredictability of a triple threat match makes this almost impossible to predict. Any one of these three could walk out of here the winner. This one's gonna be special, guys. And you get the sense that East Lansing knows it. And he's heading back in. A thunderous use of the knee. And so what's the story here for Big Show? Here we go in this triple threat match. What can he do to get the best of the other two superstars in there? Triple threat matches are dangerous because it's almost certain to turn into a two-on-one match at any time. Big Show got him there. Elias forced to play defense here. But things can change in an instant in a triple threat match. I know it's early, but if things stay the way they are, winning this match might just be a pipe dream for him. Floored by the neck breaker. The Big Show was first seen on WWE programming under his real name, Paul White. The behemoth tore through the ring and launched Stone Cold Steve Austin through the side of the steel cage at the 1999 St. Valentine's Day Massacre. Clearly employing a heavy dose of knees here. Elias definitely starting to crack here. He's starting to feel the pressure of this triple threat match, guys. This triple threat match really seems to be getting the best of him here, guys. I don't like his chances. Hey, he can still win this thing, guys. We've all seen him come back from much worse. Look at Big Show here. The Big Show has had some of those intense rivalries in WWE with the likes of The Rock, Triple H, Undertaker, Kane, John Cena, and Brock Lesnar. Big Show's issues with the authority almost went too far. It's tough to argue with the Big Show's success. The Giants the only superstar to have held the WCW, WWE, and ECW Heavyweight Championships. If that wasn't enough, Big Show won the second annual Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal at WrestleMania 31. Nice job by The Miz. 
He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. And the shoulders come up. Yeah, he's not done yet. He's got a head of steam. See how long he can sustain it. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many. Emphatic drop kick by The Miz. Can he end it here? Nope, that one misses. Boy, that was terrible. Got the reversal. The Miz is calling for it. Good job getting to the ropes there. Yeah, that could have been bad. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. This might be the... He can do it here. And he gets that big shoulder up. He is not going to go down without a fight, Michael. Great effort, but he'd better save something for later in the match. And it's Big Show getting out of that one. Here we go. Now back to the ring. Big Show's putting on a nice show for his fans. He is a one-man gang in there. He wants it one more time. That's the showstopper. Just a devastating move by Big Show. The Miz got the worst end of that stick. Man, that got him good. He landed a perfectly placed strike. That'll send a message to your adversary, all right. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. Oh boy, he is looking for the quick pin. He's got some fight left in him. Just needs to do more damage. The weapon of mass destruction. That should do. There's the cover. Can he do it? Two. The pinfall and the victory. here for two of WWE's best. Three competitors walked in with legitimate chances of winning, but in the end, only one showed the resolve and the willingness to do anything necessary to pick up the win. What a match, and a quick thank you to everybody for spending part of their Christmas with us here at the WWE. Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have Carl Anderson against Seth Rollins. Oh, we are going anywhere. Listen up, there's not a moment to spare. It's quite a drop from the top, so how are you feeling down there? Where did you think you could go? Because everyone already knows it's 20 to 1. Yes, yeah, so you better run. You got the world on its knees. You take it all that you please. You want more. Come on. But you get nothing from me. You like the burden we bear.
Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. guys. That's Seth freaking Rollins to you, Cole. And before I forget, allow me to wish everybody out there a very Merry Christmas. You know, I can't help but wonder what I did wrong to have to be spending Christmas sitting next to you two. And guys, we're ready to get this match started. When I looked at the card for tonight, this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss. Oh yeah, here's Seth Rollins. That one fails to connect. Great idea by him. Too bad it was awfully executed though. A brutal clothesline catches in the perfect spot. Let's talk about Seth Rollins for a moment. So tell us, oh, wise one, what's he got to do to win here tonight? He's Seth freaking Rollins, guys. You don't get to add freaking to your name unless you have what it takes to win each and every time you step in the ring. And believe me, Seth Rollins has it. Here in the early going, he's got a spring in his step and some fire in his eyes. We'll see if that translates to a victory. Seth Rollins looking for the quick pin. No countering that overhand punch. And he lands a crushing neck breaker. The superstar with the advantage here. Oh, oh look at outside interference. That's not cool at all. Now the official trying to do something to regain some sort of order here. Oh, come on now. And then, yeah. Smart, smart. Get to stepping. Be gone. Send him back to the locker room. Nobody's got time for this. Jeez. And the elbow finds its mark. Now we see Carl Anderson starting to slow down a bit. He's really going to need to create some space for himself. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. He's certainly in a tough spot here, guys, but there's still plenty of time. Plus, it's not like his opponent is running away with this thing. Well, at least not yet, anyway. He's 
sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Bringing it back into the ring. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. Oh, super kick! Here's his chance. Seth Rollins just changed the momentum of this match. His drop kick connects. Seth Rollins gets out of trouble and quickly. Yeah, no question. He's shown it might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Oh, the reversal by Carl Anderson. Look at Carl Anderson here. Three. Somebody stop this. Four. Connects with a counter. Seth Rollins knows how to polish off an opponent. He's got to hurry if he doesn't want to get counted out here. Time's certainly not on his side, Michael. Eight. Man, Seth Rollins, what offense. After the last time out, I think people are starting to expect amazing matches out of this superstar each and every night. Somebody wound him up and he's off and running. No person could take much more of this and Carl Anderson's not looking good. Looks to me like he just hit a wall. At this point, he's risking serious injury by continuing. I mean, he's getting absolutely torn apart in there. Yeah, things certainly appear to be trending in the wrong direction for him right now, guys. What a knee strike from the King Slayer. But he's running up shoulders down. This could be it. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. to the entire locker room with that win. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down for the three count. What a match, and a quick thank you to everybody for spending part of their Christmas with us here at the WWE.